Good morning from Snake Mountain Boat Works on Tuesday, October 28th. Yet another exciting day in the shop as our 1956 Cowhide Palomino, hull number 5652, has completed the first step in her complete preservation. Not a single piece of wood has been replaced in this process. The Abadir decks are exactly as they were the day she left the Sentry factory. The topside planking and transom is all original. We took everything down to bare wood. The top sides and covering boards have received nine coats of Jamestown Distributors Total Boat uh, brilliant black topside paint. We roll and tip it just as we do our varnish. The Avadir decks were also stripped to bare wood and that was a tough decision because they retained their original finish but it was just dull and tired and we buffed and buffed and buffed and simply didn't get the results that we want. And you'll notice something interesting about this particular model in that the deck planks stand proud of the seams unlike other boats where the seams are filled almost to the level of the planking uh, with Sikaflex, these are painted black. We couldn't be more pleased with how she came out. The Avadir is just absolutely brilliant. Her transom was in excellent shape and now is in spectacular shape. Her hull number is still stamped right in the transom so there's no doubt when this boat was manufactured and also exciting, if you'll go back to some of our earlier videos, particularly uh, the As Found video on this boat when I towed her back from the very end of Long Island. Her original 30 horsepower Johnson engine was still hanging off her transom, but it was seized very, very hard. Well, happily, We've been able to free the engine, and the engine is now out being fully restored. So we'll have an original engine with all original parts by the numbers to hang off this transom once again. So we thought you would en enjoy taking a look at her, and we'll keep you apprised as we begin installing all of the hardware bedded in dolphinite. We will not do too much to the, the bilge area. We're going to clean it from the chines down to the keel. And we'll apply a, a couple of coats of Cetol Marine, second Cetol Marine to the, to the bilge. The framing is original. We haven't replaced a single stick. In fact, we remain convinced that Snake Mountain Boatworks was the first shop to deconstruct this cowhide palomino since it left the factory. So we'll keep you apprised as we move forward and she's only going to become more beautiful and more impressive with each passing day. Thank you so much from Snake Mountain Boatworks.